Hi, welcome to an on-chip video tutorial, a short one. I want to show you how to do a broken out section view in OnShape. In other programs it's called breakout view. Therefore I will need a closed spline as profile. So if you click just on that tool, you will get the possibility to draw a spline. So let's go for a very simple spline with maybe four to five points, yeah, maybe like this. And you can control the depth of the section cut by the second view here, by this one. And I want to select this point here. Please note, the breakout will go in from that direction or in this direction. So it will come from here. It will break through the model from this point to that point or from that point to this point. That's just a matter of the viewpoint, indeed. Now I want to edit this one. So go here and then you can move those points. Now the, these points might be not enough, so I can add points. Just click onto the spline and you've got more points. Now, in order to move those points, click here, go back to edit close profile and then you should be able to move those points, see? I want to give it a more interesting shape. Yeah, maybe like this. Okay. Now, it will go up to this point, so just confirm and it will make that break out. I want to add another one and I want to control the depth by a dimension. So let's go here and draw another one over here like this. Go for edit add some points maybe like that then click here go back and the points are visible and now I can move them let's draw this a little bit in that direction and this one maybe a little bit in this direction yeah like that and now the depth should be blind and I want to go for 50 millimeters and confirm I should break out to this center here looks legit and I'm done by the way I cannot remove those breakouts at least I didn't find a way to do it, I could of course delete the complete view and make another new one. So I hope this was helpful. Hope you liked it. If you did, please give it a like or leave a comment. If you want to see more, please give it a like or leave a comment. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my Facebook head fan page. It would be very nice of you. I want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well. Thanks for watching. See you to the next one. Bye bye.